Hi, this is TJ with NetPick's Inner Circle. Welcome to our Trade of the Week. Each week we will present a swing trade that you can take or follow or track, learn from, trade for yourself with real money, whatever you choose. We're going to be focusing on one of our current strategies and it will either be an equities trade with options or a forex trade. This week's installment, we're going to focus on the US CAD, the USDCAD daily forex chart. There's a trade setting up which I'm going to walk you through. For more information, I want to invite you to our netpicks.com trading tips blog. That's where you're going to find these trades of the week and you'll be able to get updates as the trade progresses, see past trades and future trades. So let's get into the trade of the week. First of all, this little plus sign right here was an entry. It's about a little bit over a week ago. And it did trigger into the trade. The trade came off a little and now it's coming back up. And we have a chance to grab this trade if it comes up and hits the entry. We call this getting in sync with an active trade. The strategy we're looking at here is the Spotlight Power Trader. And the Spotlight is well known for shining a spotlight on the best trading opportunities using a very specific set of rules. Short trades will show up with red bars here. You can see the past trade came down and hit a target objective for 343 pips, and then it came up and stopped out with the trailing stop. So that trade's over. Long trades will show up in green, so dark green is down, light green is up. You can see that the price may come up again and hit our entry. By clicking on the setup bar right here, the whole trade shows up in the data window. We could see that our entry is at 2636. Our stop will be at 2188. And then we've got four targets and the ability to trail. This little dot right here, hopefully you could see it when the price gets to that point, then we're gonna start moving our stop. We'll follow this orange dotted line to either cut risk or begin trailing to lock in profit. The way this trade is designed, we wanna be able to scale out an even percentage of our position at target one, target two, target three, target four, and then trail the rest. You don't have to do that. You can take it all off at target one or target two, but the way I'm gonna present this trade is to peel off 20% of your position at each one of these targets, as well as the trailer. Now the targets are so far up, they're off the chart because we've had a lot of volatility enter the market. This is great for our strategy and great for us as traders. So it's really important you look at the risk profile of the trade and don't over leverage. We never recommend risking more than 2% of your capital. This trade will be risking about 448 pips. So this is one of those trades that you're gonna hang on to and let it work itself out over time. You can see that it's got some nice risk reward ratios. Each target is better than one to one. In fact, target two is better than two to one. Target three better than four to one. And if it can get there, that would be great. Chances are it won't get to all those targets and we'll be exiting with our trailing stop for a nice profit regardless. Target one's good for 650 pips, for example. You can see here 972. I mean, there's over a thousand, almost two, more than 2000 pips to these bigger targets. The likelihood of it hitting those are pretty slim, I would say, but we're still going to go as far as we can, and then we'll just let price action tell us what to do going forward. In fact, if I scrunch the chart down a little, you can see where the targets are. Okay, now I want to show you why I've selected this trade. This is a trade plan that is featured in our Spotlight Power Trader Inner Circle Owners Club. Let me turn on the automation you can see the last trade here quick look at the performance report shows a beautiful profit factor of 5.17 but look at the longs and look at the shorts even the shorts which are not nearly as good as the longs are still adequate but the longs are what we're after and that's really what this trade is it's a long trade but you could see a 95 percent win rate never losing more than two in a row, only losing one in a row, and this is a 10-year look back. So there's not a lot of trades. Spotlight is known for quality, not quantity. Quick look at the 
equity curve, you can see it continues to reach for new equity highs, including the most current trade. So this gives us a lot of confidence, of course, going forward. And the results here are based on five mini lots. Okay, so a half size full lot so that we could take off one mini lot at each target and trail the rest. So that's where these numbers come from. Clearly, if you go bigger, these numbers would be quite a bit larger. But what we're looking for is our uh, profit factor. And you could see the total dollar total for $5 a pip is pretty good, especially on the long side. So I like this trade. Now, as this trade progresses, you're going to need to know when to move the stop and where, et cetera, et cetera. So you'll want to check back to our trading tips blog for further information. Just a quick look back. I'm going to compress this down and we can just kind of go backwards and kind of see what it's done over the last several trades. You can see right here the winner. There's a small winner there. You could see a nice winner here hitting some targets and then stopping out here's a winner coming down another winner coming down another winner coming down that's a losing trade there etc no trades it's one of the beautiful things about the uh performance report and the automation you can see a nice winner here and the way the trades are set up makes for enough breathing room for this to gyrate up and down and we'll just look at the one one more going back a little further. You can see right here, pretty profitable trade coming down. And clearly when you're winning in the 90 plus percent range, it you just mostly find winners. So that's why I like this trade. And while it does seem like a big trade, the past history shows us that these big trades are attainable. This yellow trade here hit target four, and that was good for 1,255 pips, for example. All right, so we hope you enjoy this trade. There will be many more going forward. We look forward to seeing you again on our NetPix Inner Circle Trade of the Week and our NetPix Trading Tips blog. And this is TJ with NetPix Inner Circle. See you on the next one.